All right, so a little while ago, it was confirmed that I'm turning into an older version of the great brick you see before you. By the way, if you guys want some merchandise, it's in the description down below. Get your shirt. Smell as glorious as I do. How about not? But you, know, you get it. Anyhow, so there was a cooking contest that was thrown on. You guys could have put up anything. Like, you could have had me gone into the field and found a deer, bash his head in, and then sit there and had dry roasted towel. Good towel venison would have been great. But no, 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 no. No. I even saw a thing about the, about the Garzman rashes, which I wanted to try, but you guys didn't vote for that. No. You're like, what would the glorious fat commissar want to eat? What would the balding... You guys decided to have me make cookies. <laughs> cookies. Round things. She likes this idea. I don't. Okay, I really do. Still, I'm, I like cookies. Does someone help. Someone... <laughs> so again, there was a bunch of recipes submitted. I appreciate every single one of you submitting those. Um, it was a trip to see people like recommending like guardsman rations, a couple of other things. I saw did some of these see something about a uh, chicken fried towel, which I really did appreciate. Thank you. Anyhow, um, but at the end of the day. The cookie recipe won over. It's an SCP related recipe, so at some point my spatula should start talking to me. Or something else is horrible. Just as long as it wasn't made by Fun uh, Wondertainment, I think I will be fine. All things considered, thanks everyone for submitting every, uh, submitting all your all the recipes and everybody who voted on them. Today, um, I'm going to show you guys the ingredients. I'm going to get around to baking it. I told everybody I'd do this. Here we go. Blink twice if you need help. <laughs> so today, because he is a good boy, 999 is going to oversee us making the winner of the little recipe thing, which is Researcher Talorian's Simple Chocolate Chip Cookies. Look at the good boy. We are making sweets, so he is very happy. Now, Researcher Talorian's Simple Chocolate Chip Cookies is a very simple recipe. You have two sticks of butter at room temperature. You have three-fourths of a cup of brown sugar, three-fourths of a cup of regular sugar, uh, one and a half teaspoons of vanilla. We chose Madagascar vanilla because we're expensive like that in this house when it comes to eating fat and fattening things. A bag of chocolate chips, of course. And then we have two eggs. Uh, I think it's a cup and a half of sugar, two cups of flour, sorry, two cups of flour right there. We have salt, which is a half teaspoon, and a half teaspoon of baking soda. I'm a devotee of corn. Ah, blood for the blood god. Ah, shut up. All right, to get started, we're just going to add all the secondary ingredients, the butter, the brown sugar, uh, sugar, vanilla, and eggs. We're going to add all of them into a bowl, okay? Now, this is a mixer bowl. This is for a kitchen maid. The reason I have this for a kitchen maid is because I do that stuff. So... This guy and I made all fancy. Everybody got all excited about this. I'm just sitting there like, I'm just going to throw it together like the idiot I am. But everybody was like, let's just be fancy about it. How about that? I'm like, okay, fine. Oh. Little towel heads. Little towel skulls. Look at them. Yes, yeah, it's just. Yeah, you know how it is. All right. And hype. And somebody's holding out their hand. There you go. There, there, there you go. Okay, great. Water cast. All right, there we go. Over there. And now we just take, now you want this stuff room softened, so set it out for a little bit. Now take this, open it up. Yes, you want to make sure it's salted too. Just like your commissar, salty, especially after playing league. Just saying. So we have everything in there. We're not even gonna, like if you don't, don't have one of these things right here, you're going to wanna really take your time to stir this in. 
If you do have one of these things right here, well, the next part is kind of easy. Like I said, I have a kitchen aid for this kind of thing. Bought this for the hospital at some point. Can't remember when. Can't remember why. I think it was to mix stuff. But we have this little attachment on. We're just going to lower that into there. And we're going to make sure it started up nice and slow. We're not going to go that fast. Okay. Boomer moment. There we go. So we're just going to let that go nice and slow like that for a while. Let it mix in very nicely. Yes. Watch it mix. I do not recognize the bodies in the water. I do not recognize the bodies in the water. I do not recognize the bodies in the water. I'm not doing slanesh. The joke is not worth it. All right, now, now that that's mixing over here in the KitchenAid, and or you, you're you basically giving yourself advanced carpal tunnels with an intensive uh, elbow strain, what you want to do is you want to take your salt, throw it in here. You want to take your baking soda, throw it in here. And what you want to do is you want to mix this stuff up until your elbow pops. So you want to do it like that. Nice little clockwise, counterclockwise, all over the place. I will change my shirt later today. That's my joke about Zinch. <laughs> Alright, so about like this, you want this to, you want all of your, your wet stuff here to be pretty much at this kind of consistency, okay? You want it at this kind of consistency. Smooth, bald like your old man. Here we go. Now, what we're going to do is we got a simple measuring cup right here. We're going to take the dry stuff and we're just going to start spooning it in there a little bit at a time. Not that much, just enough. If it starts getting powdery and flies everywhere, you're doing a little bit too much and you're doing it wrong. Hello, little pug -lar. Hello. All right, you have every, you have all your dry in there, you have all your wet in there. All you need now is your chocolate chips. Hey, we're Mom be like, we have St. Celestine at home. St. Celestine at home. Your halo's crooked. Shut up. There you go. Okay, right there? Yep. Yes, great value St. Celestine. On sale now, $4.95 at your local Walmart. Now, of course, things like this exist for many different reasons, like um, you mix with them, you do a whole bunch of other stuff with them, but mainly they're for other people to taste test with. Okay, so don't have anything much left to do here. So what we're going to do is the two spoons method. You scrape and scrape. So you're going to take your cookies and you're going to put them in the oven at 360 until the top is a light golden brown. Why are you so angry? It's time. Researcher Talorn's basic, uh, simple chocolate chip cookies. This recipe is by Lord Stonefish. Yes. Delicious. All right, War Pucks. So, that's the whole recipe. That's the whole process. And this is the end result. Now, if you don't mind me, I'm going to go get fatter. I don't care. I'm eating all of them.
I'll fight you. You'll fight me? I'll fight you. You'll have to. Mm-hmm. Try this. That's ridiculous. Mm. Mm-hmm. 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 Now, with all that said, well, I drink from the, uh, yeah. Put this down right, right quick. Thank you guys for being with me for as long as you've been with me. We are at 18,000 subscribers. That's nutty. Um, we're steadily growing. We're already over 18,100. Um, thank you guys for being War Pugs. Uh, new merch will be coming out soon. I'm in a good mood. Cookies. Cookies. Good way to make the wife happy. Well, who cares about all that, you know? <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> War Pugs, I'm going to head out from here. Thank you for joining me. And once again, this was uh, this was uh, submitted by The Harbor, and this was a little bit of fun. It took me a little bit to do because uh, everything kept on coming up, and uh, certain people um, uh, kept on giving me reasons to uh, not do it yet, not do it yet, not do it yet. But in any case. Yeah, yeah, blame me. Yeah, I always do. There were some other great recipes in there. I prefer, I, we're going to try some of them. Yeah, we're going to definitely try some of them, especially Magnus. Magnus looked good. The um, the squig, the roasted squig. I like the look of that. We're gonna give that a shot. I'm not so sure about the honey baked towel. Um, primarily because I don't have that much food coloring. But war pugs. I'm older man. I'm balder man. Keeps reach out. Let's work something out, okay? Now, until next time. Little Lango.